Peace, peace, good peoples. You know you back with your homeboy, Wrench Turner. And yes, this is another episode of Shop Talk. No, I'm not in the shop. Why? Because it is sweltering outside. All right? And, you know, I don't want to perish. <laughs> but I do have a hot topic to discuss with you guys. All right? You've seen the thumbnail. This is going to be a real good one right here. <laughs> Let's get it, baby. Tonight I'm feeling hate. Feeling well, hate. So, with no, with no uh, filler, with no kind of um, additives, I woke up today to understand that Dodge had announced that they was going to put out the 2021 Durango Hellcat. <laughs> Now, after many different videos, all right, I've spoken about it, I talked about it, uh, excuse me, uh, let me mute this, make sure don't nobody interrupt. Uh, I, I spoke about this and I mean on, on several different videos. Um, it's a it's a joyous thing for me because I always felt like they could do this. And I mean it's not just for me. It's it's for every gearhead out there, it's for every wrench turner out there, it's for every mechanic out there, you know what I mean, that loves this, every racer, every enthusiast. Who loves this? So, let me go ahead and stop babbling or whatever and get to the to the to the milk and cookies. <laughs> All right. They announced that it's going to be 710 horsepower straight off the rip. I said, "Okay." And it 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 made me feel good to know that they was going to give it more than the initial Hellcat. I mean, if you're going to do something, make it better, right? At least that's what I was told. But 710 horsepower was 645 foot-pounds of torque. 645 foot-pounds of torque. Damn, say that fast. <laughs> and they say it's going to be more responsive because... Um, they did things with the suspension and everything. And I'm like, wasn't this what I was just talking about? You know what I mean? And it's, it's glad that, I mean, I'm glad, excuse me, that not only just me, but other enthusiasts, other people that speak about cars, you know, we have put this out here because a lot of people don't understand. When people come to us to talk about these topics because we are reporting on these topics, sometimes we are left bewildered about it. So it's good to see them doing this. This truck can tow almost a 9,000 pound load. No problem. You know, for all you guys out there with 27-foot boats. <laughs> all right. But, yeah, for all you guys that tow your Dodges to the track, you know, and they they announced that SS, too. I'm, I'm going to be getting to it, you know. So be looking for the video on that, too. And, you know, I got some notes here, so... Of course, they, they gave a launch control, and, oh, man. And then they have launch assist, but, I mean, from what I have seen, 
that's kind of typical with your uh, Hellcat. You know, you have the launch button and then you have launch control. So, I, the, the way that I'm looking at this thing is that they are putting technology that they 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 put into like red eye challenger i mean yeah challenger red eye and demon technology to make this great vehicle not only a towing monster but a track monster too you know because you know those of you that already own hellcats and have already understood that kind of the sky's the limit and you can go as far as you want to go. Some of those same guys are going to have this truck. And, I mean, I'm sitting here thinking about 2022. I mean, 2021, rather. And I'm watching a three-seat SUV make a nine second pass man man I mean you gotta see this thing man like this is this is wow this is just wow I mean that's I'm 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 glad we're here you know and for you guys that are my true subscribers that really really rock with me you guys know I've been rooting for this truck for a long time, for a long time. And I am just elated that we are here. I mean, you know, you can't expect for the, the truck to go fast. All right. It's going to be topped out right at about 150. So, you know, ain't no super speed and all that. But when you got 710 horsepower, who needs to go super fast, right? <laughs> but um you know restrictions can be taken off governance can be taken off to my true enthusiasts 2021 is going to be a hell of a year i got more videos coming soon i hope that you guys will continue to like and subscribe to my channel man thank you dodge really appreciate it. from one enthusiast from one mechanic and wrench turner i really appreciate this and i tilt my hat to you please don't forget to stop by and visit for some bridges stop by and stay fly you know the model we got new merch coming out it should be on the website very very soon so please continue to rock with us and shop with us all right remember keep your heads up Somebody loves you. Let's support a bunch of time. Oh, yeah. Peace. <laughs>